Hey there team, just wanted to do a quick overview of the new security uh, part of Windows 10. So I'm running uh, Windows 10 1909 update. Uh, as soon as the uh, first quarter, or I guess 2004 update comes down from Windows 10, I'll be updating then and I could probably redo this video then. But I went ahead and uninstalled the Bitdefender paid version that I have. Uh, so that way I could see how the uh, security piece works here. So the quickest way to get to it is hit the Windows key, type in security, and it'll be Windows security right there. Uh, it'll, you have the option to go to your home, virus and threat protection. This is going to be the quickest way for you to run a scan on your machine to determine if you have a virus. So you have a couple of different scan options. You can do quick, full, custom, offline scan. Um, cool about the offline scan is it actually takes your machine completely offline and scans it effectively in a safe mode. Um, I really think that is a, a potentially good way for you to roll. Most of the time, a or if you sorry, this is a really good way to roll if you're having a really bad infection. Um, if it's just a normal kind of run-of-the-mill thing, I find that the quick scans work really well. Uh, they work, you know, again, it's Microsoft's tool and they just, they work pretty darn well. Um, so here under check for updates, like that's, it's updating on a very regular basis. Microsoft's probably pushing it out every four to six hours. Um, you can obviously check for updates right there to make sure you have the most current security intelligence. We're going to go back here. Um, manage ransomware protection. I have mine currently off for the moment because as soon as I'm done with this video, I'm going to go ahead and reinstall our managed uh, antivirus. Um, but you can do controlled folder access. Basically, that allows you to block things from, blocks unfriendly ac uh, applications from installing into your computer. Um, if you're not using a paid version of something, I really recommend this with the caveat that you understand that it could absolutely cause an issue with um, installing applications. So in the future, if, if you turn this on and you try installing applications in the future, this definitely can cause a problem. So be really careful with it. I'm going to turn mine back off. You can see here it's checking for updates. A quick scan, like you see right here, took about two minutes. If you did a full scan, it would probably take, I mean, they, they say it could take longer than an hour. I'm using a solid state, so it would probably only take 10 or 15 minutes. Um, and right here with a custom scan, you can even choose which files and folders you take a look at and want to scan. So if you have something that you, you're pretty sure is bad. so. Just a quick overview of the new Windows Defender security at a glance. Um, I don't even really call it Windows Defender anymore. It's just uh, Windows security. Uh, so there, hopefully that answers your questions. Have a great day.